Ah, this control click, and I'll take it all. All right, let's go, people. We're going to go. One, two, three, blast off. And I'm going to go out. And then where's my planet? Uh, oh boy. Here. <laughs> Let me give it, give me a second. Uh, I need to go back to where I was. Follow rotation, lock the North Pole, following off. Now, I just kind of want to see where was I? Where was my other... Here it is. I think this is where I was. Alright, let's go. Hey, Stanislaw, that's right. Let's go. Let's be a fast robot. Is there a place you can go within the star map or the menus where, like, you can see a list of the planets that you have settlements or facilities built on, and then you can quickly pin them or navigate to them or something like that? I'm thinking like No Man's Sky, where like, you know, you have the uh, expedition log and you can see everything you used to, you know, discover within each system and all that jazz. I should rename this planet. That would make my life easier. Oh, cool. Thank you. From the production menu. Okay, you can rename them. Yeah, let me click on this. Right, I'm going to call this um, Starting Incompetence. And we got an achievement. I mean, why not, right? Okay, let's just see where's our stuff. Let's go this way. All right, here's our factory doing its thing. Mm, red science. Not so good. What's going on over here, red science? Mm, I'm not sending very much uh, graphite up here, am I? I know why that is. Let's follow this back. Oh, there's a lot of coal happening. Hmm. Well, I mean, is that the bottleneck? Let me see with my red science. Too many smelters for a level one belt. Right. So what we should do then is... I have... Upgrade the belt, maybe. I know, Morgan. The music is great, isn't it? All right, let's see if I can make a better belt. Hmm... Oh, wow. Oh, that's because I don't have... I need to do the logistics. I do have power plants fo pulling. But here's my focus. My focus right now needs to be setting the logistics system up because um, I want m my personal resources to be topped off. So I have one bot that I think I made. But I need to set the logistics. So let's see about this. 
Well, I could put the titanium away for now. Let me build a storage facility like right here. Okay, Lewis. Thanks so much for all your help, my friend. Take care. All right. So here's what we need to do. I want the robots. And the robots are here. And the problem with the robots is that we need this. And these need magnetic coils, which we should have plenty of. Yeah, they were pretty full. Hey, Richard, what's up, my friend? You know, what I could do... It's like, this is trying to distribute to this line, but it gets choked because of the T-junction right here. And I feel like it's not feeding as much as it could. What I'm trying to accomplish with logistics red, uh, robots is um, getting it so that I have my inventory. Like, you'll notice I go to, I don't have any magnetic coils, for example. Like, I want magnetic coils to be permanently in my inventory. That's optimal. That's great. All right. So... All items that I'm interested in, I just want them dumping into my main inventory with logistics bots, if possible. So, I've got magnetic coils somewhere going into a storage. Here they are, right? And I can just take out some stacks, but... What does this mean? Right, so I've put a few on Red Hat. I've been making a few of the distribution centers, and now I've been making robots. But like, so for example, well, I can only have six items for the distribution at the moment or something. Settings. Um... At least... Okay, thank you. At least 400 is what I want. So am I telling... If I do this, am I now telling my logistics robots, keep me with at least 400 of these things? And then at most, you know... Thank you. Okay, a thousand. So I'm like, just give me between, you know, at least 400. And then if I get more than, well, I don't need a maximum. Just give me 400. That's fine. Okay. And then, yeah, I need to put a, a distribution robot on, uh, thing on top of it. You're right. Okay. So then let me go to this and let's make a distribution thing, um, but this t is going to take what's the slowdown on this? We don't have enough copper? Is that what it is? Alright. That's something that definitely needs to be on the distribution network. Oh, I have one, actually. I have a logistics distributor up here and it doesn't have any robots, though. So I have to put them, like... Okay, I put nine robots. Each one takes robots, or are these for the whole network? Okay... Okay, they only do one job. Okay. So 
So I told them to provide and collect, but they're not doing anything. At the moment. I have 200. Oh, maybe... No, I have 200 plus this. Okay. Thank you. I didn't realize that... I thought this was just a, a picture of it. I didn't realize it was also counting. This is a stack of 200. And then there's another stack in my inventory. Okay, okay. That's cool. That's great. Okay, so I definitely want this for copper and iron at the time being. So let's set that up. Where is my copper? Here's copper. There's very, I really don't have that much stored, though. This is an old storage unit. I'll just take all this. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can make some more of these. I can make 12. All right, so we really only need to have six, so. And then we'll make a bunch of the robots. And this will start just making sure that I don't take off and, you know, not have enough of what I'm looking for. And then items, robots. How many can you make? Yeah, make it all. Okay, great. All right, where's my copper coming in from? This is a lot of it. And this is some of it. But I don't have a... I'm not stockpiling it anywhere? That seems... Irresponsible. Looks like it. I need a big box full of copper. Yeah, here they do come. That's so great. I love these drones. Okay. I need to put a storage facility on this line somewhere. All right, there goes copper. Here comes a whole bunch of copper. All right, interesting. Make some more storage for me. Oh my god, I'm out of iron. Well, iron I could set up because I actually store iron. We need more iron than this. This is woefully inadequate. Oh no, wait, I have my whole iron thing. Let me see how that's doing. I should have so much iron that it's like, yes, here we go. Yes, that makes sense. Okay. So right here, I'm just actually storing steel, which is great. But where is my iron? It should be right over here, and it is. Let's go ahead and build a logistics distributor right on top. And then um, let me click on this and just give it as many robots as I have. Which apparently I don't have any. I'm kind of sad about it. I'm making some though. I just have to make all these different parts. Which takes forever. Alright. Well in the meantime. We'll start setting up the rest of the network. So I want. At least 600. Of this. Yeah, I think that's way too many for one. You're right. And then... Let's see what else we want. We want copper. I want at least 600. Uh, I probably want gears and... Um, regular. Well... 
I definitely think I want graphite because I don't want to have no power. That's looking good. We are about to start making some robots here. Once I make these... I'll dump like three into this one. Alright. I put all three in there. And there they go. And they're giving me the iron. Top me off. So you can see there's a downward arrow, meaning like I don't have enough. And then eventually they'll give it, they'll give me enough and then I'll, this will be satisfied. Okay. Now let me see, did we get it? We got it. All right, let me go in here and I can take some of these out. Can I split the stack? I didn't want to take that many out, but. Um, right click, here we go. Just drop five in there. All right. Now, let's go, yes, okay. Do I want these, like, basic? Ah, uh, these are pretty good. Sometimes you need these. Here they come. They're delivering me the goods. All right. Now I'm getting good in terms of like having a better inventory set up. Okay. Now I just need to go make sure that the copper is coming in and that the graphite is coming in and we're good to go. Alright, so what I'm going to do is just going to drop down. And then we will go to storage. I need to make a bunch of storage boxes, but this will be easy now that I have so many. Hey. Victrola, what's up, my friend? Thank you for following. Alright, so now we're making all of these boxes. And what we can do is create this storage for... Oh, we're waiting for all these robots to be made. It's going to take forever. Can I shift this to the front of the queue? Can I be like, prioritize it? No, okay. Well, that's sad, but that's okay. It happens. Then let's go do the graphite while we're waiting on that. Oh, I have a box right here, actually. Well, then... Nah, I don't want to put it on... Yeah. I got it. I don't want to put the dr drone building on top until I have four tall. This one I don't need four tall on. I'm not doing that. So I'll just uh, put this right there. And then this one. How many robots do I have? You can take, you know, this many. And there we go. Now they're topping me off. That looks great. Tremendous. So, now, if I'm looking at this correctly, 
You see how it says distribute to other distributors on the logistics distributor screen? Do these function like requester boxes in Factorio where it's like I can just if something that I'm building needs graphite for example I can just put a box right there that says give me graphite and the the bots will come drop it in there so I don't have to run a belt it, but I can't really I don't see how on this screen I can set how many I want inside a box unless it just tries to fill up the entire thing okay they don't have a big range so then it doesn't matter anyway about uh, the question that I'm asking but that's interesting okay alright then let's see hey hot dog good evening my friend better late than never my friend I hope you're well Okay, that makes sense, Red Hat. You have the automation capacity bar on the bottom. Oh, okay, thank you, of the storage box. I see, right, right, right. That's perfect, okay, thank you. All right, then let's go ahead and drop a, um, oh, you know what? I don't have one of these built, but I'm gonna take it. I thought I wanted, well, you know what? I'm going to clear this off of here. I'd actually rather have um, these. Not that many. And then now we'll click on this and, you know, give it a bunch. And there we go. Okay. Now, I don't need this, so I'm going to... I'm going to take that off my steel. I don't... I was putting down way too many. I started putting it on, like, every single container. Um, and that's a little unnecessary. We are familiar with the production method of high-strength crystals. You can now utilize organic crystals to strengthen the lattice structure of titanium atoms. It will obtain a special titanium atom crystal to titanium crystal. Okay. Uh, let's see. So and now, yes, this is what I need to do. I need to go to transportation. We want to stick this on top of here. And now this isn't going to do anything until we actually, um, you know. Something like that. All right, now this will start flowing more freely. Um, wait, this isn't, this is not going anywhere. I don't know what I'm doing right here, but this needs a belt. Yeah, this is a mistake. There, go. Okay. So let me look at my character, and the only thing I'm missing are gears and copper. Actually, I have too many. At least 600. Oh, no, I don't have too many. Okay. All right, let's put the robots in here then. All right, robots. Uh. Hmm. Confusing.
Oh. Item filter is not set. What? Huh. Oh, I think I must have built that before I had items inside. And it so it didn't automatically. I hadn't had to do that before. Now we got it. Alright, now it's just gears that I'm short on, but I have to actually get closer to the gears for it to work, I believe. Because um Either that or well, there's gears right here. Maybe I just need to build it. Maybe I never even built it. I just assumed I would need that. I mean, that, that seems like something I would do, but... Um, okay. Build me... One more of these. Just one. These take forever. Right, let me get rid of some stuff while I'm waiting. I have all this blue science. Just take it. It won't take it. It's backed up. Alright, let's get this red science thing fixed. This is a disaster. I can't go get titanium if my red science is looking this paltry. Alright, so let's boost it. Red Science, how you doing? What's going on? It's still this. So this is fine. I wonder if I... Yeah, I just have too many... Um, power plants drawing. Or too many smelters. But either way... I've got a lot of coal coming in. That takes too long. Yeah. I'm doing too much work on one belt. Hey, Spiny, thanks for the follow. Yes, I need to split this belt up. So, like, these two miners... I have an idea. I don't think this is going to kill my power. Let me see where I'm at. <laughs> yeah, hot dog. It's like... Uh, it, it's an automation factory game where you have a mech and you fly across multiple planets. It's bonkers indeed. All right, so here's my, my plan. I'm going to simply take this this way. No, wait. It didn't work right. Um, this is what I want. Okay. So now we have two miners. And these miners are going to feed six. 